take a look at that. Could be frightening or amazing depending on who's speaking. So imagine this, spending minutes, hours, or a day suspended hundreds of feet above the ground and handling live electric conductors. Now for you and I, it's an imagination, but for a team of engineers and technicians attached to the Kenya Power Air Mobile team, that is a routine. And Oxycolia caught up with them while maintaining the Suswa Isenia power line. Their quest is to keep electricity flowing. The high voltage line from Olkaria power plant is surveyed and maintained by workers balancing, walking and sometimes sliding on live cables. For the pilot, he has to place his team safely on the conductors. It takes them hours to just finish the job. This is an extremely dangerous occupation. No mistakes is allowed in that department. It's still life. Kenyans are still getting their power. And safety is paramount. You can endanger your life. You can also endanger the life of the pilot and other crew members and also the aircraft. Kitu ya kwanza naweka inji yangu ya Kenya mbele. Ya pili ni kampuni yangu ili endelea kwa biashara ile tunafanya ya kuuza steam. Na pia najali kuna wagonjwa wako na mahali kwa hospitali wanahitaji steam ili wapate oxygen ili wafanye kupumua. Steam ikienda chini oxygen inakuwa kato. Ya kama wakati huku kuna corona. Naona hiyo ventilator zinatumia steam sana sana. Uh, my name is Derek Otieno Nyango. I've been in Kenya Power for the last six years. I've been working with Air Mobile team. We usually do uh, transmission line maintenance, both live. Actually, it's usually live, and uh, I'm a technician with Ke- electrical technician at Kenya Power. The public had a first glimpse into the operations of Kenya Power's Air Mobile team on Saturday after the country was plunged into total darkness. The most difficult uh, scenario is uh, in 2018 April when we had uh, three transmission structures swept by Sabaki River. And uh, that was one of the most difficult moments. Sasa ni mwaka wangu ya sita. Nikifanya hiyo kazi mara kama mbili kwa mwezi ama tuseme ni regular job. Lakini wa Kenya hawajaiona. Hawajaiona sana sana tunakuanga kwa msitu. Hiyo ni wakati ile wamepata nafasi ya kukuja wakakuja wakachukua hiyo video ionekane. Saila anabonyesha pale kwa ukuta stima iwake. Ajue kuna mtu kama mimi hapo pale msituni anafanya apate hiyo stima kwa nyumba. Derek Otieno and Patrick Mao are live men in the mobile team. For them, danger is always looming. To ensure safety, proper coordination between them and their pilot, Major Alex Koech, is paramount. This operation is very dangerous. It needs highly trained personnel. For one to be safe in the air, proper groundwork must be done. A preliminary test is conducted to test the electrically controlled hand line to ensure it's serviceable. We are the live men in that department. We usually coordinate with our pilot through our radios. Yes, and we usually use signs for communication usually because the hand line is long and uh, the pilot can't make judgment that you are at certain level. When we are doing this kind of operation, the helicopter door is removed. You, there's no door because I have to see them physically. If you don't see them physically, there's no one time you will lift a person and you're not seeing where he is. Because he can swing and can hit, can hit some obstacles or the power line. So every time you must see the person you are lifting. So you need to tell him when to take you up. When you want to take, you tell him to take you up, you just make this signal. This is take me up. When you want him to take you down, you just do, you make this signal, is take you down. When you want him to stop, just do this. Once I'm on top of the, the pylon, he gives me the signs to tell me go down, go down. When, once he's on top of the, uh, uh, on top of the tower, it does like this. That's when I know he has reached. So I stabilize the aircraft and I stop there. He lands on the tower, he, he, he removes the, my line, and then I leave. But in case 
uh, there is something that is not being seen by either the pilot and the live man, what we do is we give a, a radio signal to either the pilot and the, the live man who also have, and I notice by them that there is something or a lacking danger. When we land there, if it's uh, inspection, we usually check the insulators. We also check the hardware like the bolts and nuts, and also we check the whole structure. Then we check the whole line, the conductors, how they are. And if it's on live condition that we want to do now, our maintenance, we usually maintain the insulators. We do change over wind insulators. There is the excitement of finding the problem. Then there is the challenge of fixing it up. Enoxicolia, Citizen TV, Ngong, Kajado County.